What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Road to E3. It's time to talk about South Park, the Fractured Butthole. <laughs> That's, I'm sorry, every time. I, I can't help it. Brian, this was announced at E3 last year. Yeah. I don't think we've seen it since then. Totally dark. It's just that E3 announced trailer, and I, I really cannot wait for this game because the, the Stick of Truth, which was a, uh, a role-playing game in the sort of light Paper Mario mm -hmm. style type combat, uh, was seriously almost my game of the year that year. Sure. Um, it was it definitely was my favorite RPG of that year. And uh, this game, The Fractured Butthole, promises to be at least similar in the fact that it's a you know lighter RPG. We're hoping for some deeper combat, but yeah, I mean, what's I, I I'm stoked for this. What are you most excited about to see next? Probably what changes they've made. Mm -hmm. uh, it got criticized for being a little too easy, a little too light. Uh, in fact, their own announced trailer last year sure. sort of poked fun at the, f the game's few weaknesses from, from the Stick of Truth, including the combat. So uh, I'm curious to see what, what kind of depth they've added to it. What do you think the likelihood is that it, of it being at E3 this year? It, I, would, I would bet on it if I were a betting man, which I am. Uh, gambling's got, not legal. Got some but, money you know. riding on this. <laughs> but you know, there is also, that, uh, that, that Matt Stone and Trey Parker factor of they really, they control South Park, they are gonna do whatever they feel is best. So if they decide, even at the last minute, like nah, we're not, we don't wanna show it or we're not ready to show it, they won't. But I think a whole year of nothing yeah. means we're gonna get a, a showing this year at E3. Cool, thanks Ryan. For more on South Park and all the big games of E3, stay tuned to IGN.